everybody. It's been a long time since we've done a podcast, so we thought today would be a fun one to do. We're here in College Station, Texas, in the parking lot for Reed Arena for the uh, Teeks and Texas EMS Municipal Vendor and show they do training here all week for the folks in the fire school side. We're here with the Corsicana unit today, which happens to be a red unit, and today it is currently a balmy 97.5 degrees per the temperature gauge sitting back here on the rear bumper. Today we want to talk to you about the new AC system that we have. It's a 410 system, still 110 volt, 120 volt, still plugs in off of shore power, working off shore power, right now working off of genset. Uh, this is back to a self-contained unit. It has the micro coil technology, a very large condenser on it, and it cools like a son of a gun. Let's go inside. A couple nice things about this unit that we're using right now. We've gone to, we have the standard vent that we have here blowing towards the action wall CPR seat. And we've also added a second vent that blows at the squad bench. Uh, we are running outside. We have a little, we have a weather station over here at the action wall that's reading the temperature from the thermometer that we have on the rear bumper which is currently 97.7 degrees and inside right now it is 70.5 degrees so we've got a differential of just over 27 degrees. Uh, we're going to see it's supposed to get over 100 here in College Station today so we're going to be watching this all day see what it can do from an AC standpoint. We've also done some different things as far as our insulation goes uh, to make sure that when it does get cold in here it stays that way. We have a double pane windows, uh, double pane windows on all of our entry doors. We also use a blown in foam style insulation in the walls. We also use that on our entry doors as well as uh, a radiant heat barrier style insulation on the on the entry doors. Same setup that we're using in the ceiling as well with the with the blown in insulation. So I know it has been a hot summer. It's this is standard fare for the folks here in the southwest part of the country, but I know the, the other folks are seeing temperatures that they haven't seen in many years, so y'all just need to come down to Texas where this is, this is normal. Um, just goes to show you what having a nice AC will do for you, and we're still tracking, like I said, right at a 27 degree differential from the outside air. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, this also happens to be a red unit. Even the roof is red. Don't even, we don't even have a white roof on this unit. So um, with the exception of possibly one of our customers who runs a black ambulance, it's, it's a worst case scenario as far as heat intrusion uh, is concerned. 